Ladies and gentlemen, what's going on? Once again, I'm Nev from Nev's Tech Bits. Today we're going to be checking out a Dell Weiss terminal uh, with an Atom X5 chip. Pretty sure that that is an x86 chip. So uh, ultimately, originally what I wanted to do was try to install a Windows OS on this. I mean, it's got 2 gigs of RAM. That's minimum for windows 10 so we could give it a shot unfortunately i uh, don't have the tools available or i don't have the hardware available that's needed to do that job so instead i'm just going to do a tear down and maybe a look at what happens when we turn this sucker on now here we can see the front unit it's got two usbs a headset we have uh, lots of holes for the cpu we have ethernet to display to USB and then the power brick of course of course now in order to get this thing open you just crack the shell off uh, from the bottom and then you can see exactly what's on the inside you don't need to take the feet off the feet will only uh, show you the mounts I've already removed the feet so to get this thing open just crick crack that's all that's all it takes so it's interesting at the bottom here we got a little bit of a gooey thermal uh, thermal cake there. It looks like it looks like it goes right against where the CPU would be. So it's a, a bit of thermal transfer for where the CPU would be. There we have the uh, BIOS battery, and that looks like is where the M2 card is going to go. That is a, a SATA M2 card, a mini one. And if you were to get this thing going, you definitely need one of those cards. And here I'm just going to try to get it out so we can take a look at the top part of the unit. But yeah, we have uh, giant, giant fanless design. A lot of people prefer fanless designs because fans are one of the only things these days that can actually wear out, that can actually uh, physically wear out and break down, whereas the rest of it, the electronics take uh, far longer, far longer to uh, break down. But yeah, I don't have one of these m2 card specifically one of these ones so there's nothing i can do anyways this thing only has two gigabytes of ram on once again that is good for minimum windows 10 but uh, i it's just it just wouldn't be worth it for me to get one of those uh memory cards i believe if you want to get this working you have to get uh, the bias loaded up on it first and then and then you can use it but the the reward isn't really all there for it right now anyways for those of you who don't know this is a, uh, a Weiss terminal is uh, so unsexy it's a tech uh, it's a network person's dream and um, unfortunately it takes all the sexiness out of computers it's just a unit it's just a dummy terminal that gets information from a server and as a hardware guy, I'm not a big fan of them, but it is fun to see what's on the inside of them, and it is fun to see how far we have come. Well, that's it for me, folks. Have a good one. Take care of each other.